chairman of Shakti Sugars, has joined us on the phone line. Morning, Mr. Manikam. Thanks so much for joining. Well, if you can give us first some details. Uh, what's the volume and price breakup for the fourth quarter itself and why this jump in finance cost? Okay, see, what has happened in the previous uh, comparable quarter of March 2016 versus March 2017, uh, we had actually taken credit of some of the benefits that we got from the lenders with uh, settlements that we arrived. Mm. So that's why the finance cost has actually, if you look at the, you know, it was about 5.37 crores in 31-3-2016. It's about 44 crores now. This is the actual uh, price that we're paying, like 120 crores a year of financial cost. Mm. So the current year, we have actually booked the right cost. So you're looking at about 40 crores. Uh, addition costs, uh, that's uh, basically where the difference comes in. Okay. Uh, Mr. Manikam, uh, good morning. Uh, you know, a lot of people believe FY18 is going to be a record year for sugar companies. Uh, uh, do you have the that kind of visibility for your company as well? Um, not really for South because we are going through a bad uh, drought. Our volumes are going to be going down to half. In fact, uh, this year, you know, our crushing was uh, something like... Uh, uh, 19 lakh tons of cane and uh, next year we are not going to do more than 10 lakhs. So you are looking at a much lower uh, cane crush uh, versus uh, the current year. So I don't expect that we will do much better next year unless uh, we do more raw sugar and right now raw sugar imports are not uh, that open. It's under the government control. Mm -hmm. So we are just waiting to see how the government comes back with that. Okay. You, I thought you didn't give us the volume price breakup. Yeah, I'll just give you one moment. See that we've done roughly about this year 20 lakh tons of cane. Mm, okay. uh, roughly 19.7 lakh tons of cane. Mm. And uh, average realization is about 34.85. Okay. So 34.85 is the average realizations. I just wanted the forecast for the next year but before that also your thoughts on uh, the recent hiking of the sugar FRP prices by the government. Uh, is the Tamil Nadu government looking to implement sugarcane pricing as per the FRP or uh, as per the uh, Rangarajan formula and what would the impact be on a company like yours? Yeah, see, actually if you look at it, this happened that uh, you know, previous uh, government had made I think about seven, eight years back by increasing the FRP and saying the state government should not announce any price. And they also gave subsidies of some 2,000 crores a year to the state governments to you know, implement this. Uh, the two states, UP and Tamil Nadu, took the subsidies but actually didn't go ahead and implement uh, you know, stopping SAP. They continued SAP. Okay. So now I think the reason that the government is talking about a hike in FRP is to bring the FRP closer to realistic price. Mm. And uh, not having the state governments announce it. Okay. This government, with the kind of power that it has and the influence that it has over the states, and the fact that UP is now uh, governed by BJP themselves. So we think maybe this is the best chance that we have for the industry that we do away with the state and price prices as a single, uh, single you know, FRP issue. pricing. Okay. Absolutely. Okay. So uh, finally, before we let you go, you said 34.85 was the average realization this year. Uh, you don't expect yeah. to do any better than that next year, is what uh, you we mentioned? We will do probably about 200 to 250 rupees better. Currently, we're selling about 36, 37. Hmm. And if the FRP increase also comes in, we might have the prices go up by another one or two rupees. So we're looking at something like uh, 37, 38. Okay. So you'll be increasing the realization by about 2 to 3 rupees. Okay. All right. We'll leave it at